What I've got here is the Marauder Bomber Sprue for Aeronautica Imperialis. Uh, this is the only multi-sprue kit in the starter. You've got the fuselage wings and engines on this sprue and you've got a weapon specific sprue with the tail fins and turrets and ordnance. Uh, this is probably because they'll do a Marauder Destroyer and I'll just change this half sprue for something else. With, well, basically the Marauder Destroyer weapons. It lets them easily do variants and all they've got to do is tool a half size sprue. So this will be interesting because this is much more explicitly a bomber than the Orc Fighter Bomber and its performance in the game reflects that. I'm going to do it up as a 25 point bomber so I'm going to give it one set of um, wing and then I've got a perfectly 100 point aside balanced starter set force. So looking at this, the detailing is very nice. Yeah, I can't wait to put this together. So I'm going to come back in a minute, having separated and cleaned all of these from the sprue, and I'm going to build a Marauder Bomber for you. So I've got all the pieces ready to assemble. But this is what you'll end up with at the end. I've not stuck the turrets in, because I want to be able to paint them separately. Because they strike me as something that, if you glue them in, you're going to find a bit fiddly to get to. But this is how they fit together. Your front las cannon turret, your dorsal turret, and your tail turret. But yeah, so how do you build it? Right, you've got two halves of the fuselage. In here, you're going to want to get this in, which is the air intake. So that's actually a bit of a pain to get it in. So I put some glue in, Let's zoom in a little further, because this is a little fiddly piece. So you get it in and then you just push it into place like so, so it's flush. So again, you've got a little fiddly piece and you push it into place like so, because then you've got this air intake. So, once you've done that, it's time to glue these two halves of the fuselage together. A nice decent bit of glue on each part that will let you slide that in together. So I'm in fact going to put together the cradles for the front and rear turrets now because then the glue on those will be set when I come back later stick them into the plane. So this basically fits into the nose and the tail. I'm getting that out of the way now is only a good thing. So, I've given that a minute to set. This top piece is going to come along here, which completes the cockpit. And it goes here. This bit's going to need a bit more glue. in quite hard. We're getting a little bit of road glue here. So 
So I'll clean that off with a knife. In the belly, you've got the Bombay doors. So, you've got a fuselage that's reasonably well put together. These are built so you can attach these straight away, which helps keep that fuselage together while the glue sets. that minute to dry. So we've got the engine sets. What we want to do is put these on there. They can only go one way because there is a key in each of the nubs for them. So I'm going to leave those dry for a minute. While that happens, I'm going to work on the turrets. Because doing so, so a lot of the smaller pieces built. And out of the way. And then once the two holes are stuck together, apply a bit of glue. Dorsal turret built. Apply a bit of glue. Bang, tail turret built. Apply a bit of glue. That's the nose last cannon turret built. So with those out of the way, it's time to sort the wings out. And bang. one wing done. Next wing, dry fit. Bit of super glue, not super glue, plastic glue. Then a bit of glue on the 
inside and the engine intakes go on. So then, while those are drying, let's put the tail on. Which has to be put on after you've put this rear piece on. And then with that done, So we've got a couple of bombs here, I'm going to put them in the third slot along because with Marauders you've got four ordnance slots, you can make them 31 points just by buying extra ordnance. So, how do these fit in? They fit in like this. So let's get a good bit of glue. Stick one wing on. Stick the other wing on. So that is the Marauder built with three turrets. Let's compare it to the Thunderbolt, the Dacker Jet, and the Fighter Bomber. So it's the biggest of the aircraft in the starter set. It's certainly the toughest with five structure points. It's also the slowest, uh, but it is specifically a bomber. You can tool it up to hunt aircraft by giving it lots of rockets, but it's very slow for that purpose. And I'd only really do that if you know that you're facing an opponent who's taking something really slow, like a super heavy bomber, and then you could use that as a bomber destroyer. Same, same as I've kitted out my fighter bombers. So I've kitted them out with extra guns and rockets, and I've done so so that they are superiority fighters because they're as tough as a Marauder and faster and they now roll more dice up close. So if you've liked this video hit like and subscribe. If you want to chat leave a comment below but otherwise good gaming.